Bishak says, 10 meter contest is coming up. Any simple antenna suggestions? Oh. The um, it, it's not this coming weekend, but the next weekend, I think it's like the 10th and 11th mm -hmm. of December is the ARRL 10 meter contest. Um, the simplest 10 meter antenna and probably one of the most effective will be the dipole. And they're easy to make. Um, 468 divided by your frequency in megahertz gives you the, the length of a half wave. So you would cut that in half. So approximately eight-ish feet on each leg for 20, we'll say 28.4. Oh, eight, uh, 28 eight and a quarter. Eight and a quarter. Yeah, 28.4 megahertz. Yeah. So well, I'll eight, tell you what, if you get it anywhere close there, usually it's going to be broadband enough that it covers most of the 10, uh, most, 10 meter band. And most of the 10 meter TV, band. Just saying. Yeah. And it'll work in, and the great thing about the 10 meter contest, it's open to technicians. So, yeah. and you can do it. You can do it because there will be plenty of activity in the technician portion of the 10 meter band. That's where most to, of it is. It really is. Yeah. Yeah. Um, CW, uh, voice, phone, those are all, those are all available to you. Um, dipole antenna, um, the vertical, you know, eight and a quarter foot vertical with, um, some ground networks, you know, a little ground network. You could do the that too. I would probably only need to get 20 feet in the air too. Yeah. Don't so I was going to say, did you know that my first homebrew antenna was the 10 meter dipole? I think so. you gave it to me. <laughs> So at least I is think that where center, it went? The center, the center feed uh, you gave to me. Is that where I it went? Populated it. Yeah, I was gonna, I was gonna rebuild it for the ten meter contest, but so. Oh yeah, so uh, for the past eight years, you haven't been at the ten meter contest because you gave it to me. No, I've been. I got, I got, I got the the, the other big antenna, but I oh, built that ten meter oh, yeah. antenna. Yeah, I, I built that ten meter antenna when I, I got my little Radio Shack um, transceiver. So I needed an antenna for that. And I hung it up, you know, about 15, 16 feet. That's yep. all you needed to do for, for 10 meters. And, um, you know, it works. Yeah. So that, I think that's the simplest, the simplest antenna. There's, there's lots of instructions. You know, you don't need a lot of fancy, you don't have to buy a lot of fancy stuff to, to get it put together. You know, it's a simple center connector, coax, and 16 and a half feet of wire. So yeah. it's, um, get you on the air. I'm going to be on... I'm, I'm planning to do the contest. I'm planning to build an antenna for it. So hopefully so it's not too, too, end up, too was cold. The beginning of November, there are the uh, sweepstakes. I was mm -hmm. working everything on 10 meters. I worked Cape Verde on 10 meters, okay? I'm talking yeah. Africa on 10. So 10 is opening up, guys. Don't discount it, it. Get out there and have some fun. It is. It, absolutely. Yep. Yep. KB9 VBR antennas are simple, effective, and affordable VHF and UHF antennas for amateur radio, MERS, public safety, and GMRS. Made in the USA with quality parts. Get yours online at jpol-antenna.com.